So what is up bosses, it's your boy Boss Fat Mod, and welcome back to Hitman 2. We now move on to the Three-Headed Serpent, which is a mission in Santa Fortuna. Good morning, 47. Our Providence contact has shared the identity of the Shadow Client, a former mercenary and bodyguard by the name of Lucas Gray. His past is a black void, but our analysts are digging deep. Meanwhile, we've had a breakthrough of our own. Comparing the malicious attack patterns with global shipping and transportation routes, we've figured out how Mr. Gray and his paramilitaries move around the world undetected. They're using the distribution network of the Delgado Cartel, Colombia's biggest drug manufacturer. Clearly, Gray must have struck a deal with the Delgados. Consequently, if we can cripple the cartel, we can severely limit the malicious strike range. But to do so, we need to slay a three-headed serpent. Sociopathic cartel head Rico Delgado and his two closest lieutenants, PR guru Andrea Martinez and savant chemist Jorge Franco. With equal parts guts and guile, Rico Delgado runs a thriving billion-dollar criminal empire. The word is, the brutal and volatile cartel head is hell-bent on becoming the number one drug lord in the world. To achieve this, Martinez, a childhood friend of Delgado's, has been buttering up state leaders and decision makers, paving the way for an expansion of the Delgado Logistics Network, while the brilliant but aloof and antisocial Franco has been hard at work developing a new type of super cocaine. So, three of Colombia's most infamous crime lords inhabiting a decidedly hostile environment. I will leave you to prepare. And of course, the mission status is in fact active. This seems very interesting. So we got drug lords and they're inventing a new type of cocaine, okay? That seems a bit freaking weird. So I'm actually gonna do this this time. I made a mistake last time because actually it shows here that I do have stuff. But last time, if you remember, I didn't actually have anything going into the mission. But now, as you can see, we do have stuff. So I guess, yeah, I guess that's all fine. Difficulty is casual. Is it casual? Um... Do I want to, I, I guess, just stay in casual? Yeah, I'm not that great at the game, so I'm fine with staying as casual. And we've got three targets. we got Rico, George, maybe, and Andre. Welcome to Colombia. Oh, we're in a forest, okay. The remote village this seems of Santa cool. Fortuna awaits you deep inside the Colombian rainforest. An iron-fisted Delgado cartel rules over the village and its surroundings. Security around Santa Fortuna and the closed-off cartel compound is extremely tight. Armed Sicarios patrol the streets of the village, ready to enforce harsh punishment. This is cool because I literally, I haven't seen anything beyond the first mission. Like, the last mission that we played was the first part that I hadn't seen anything about. So after that, I'm completely clueless. Now, the first game was fun playing, but I'd seen bits of each of the missions. I've, I've only seen bits of the first thing that we did in the game which is part one expect that all targets are protected by scrupulous killers armed with automatic weapons rico delgado inhabits his fortified mansion on the outskirts of the village while andrea martinez can be found in her village office or around santa fortuna itself and jorge franco is engaged oh in jorge i thought it was freaking george field laboratory happy hunting 47 Hell yes, here we go. Eliminate Rico, Jorge, and Andre, or Andrea. I completely forget how you freaking say her name as well. Probably freaking saying her name wrong as well. I wouldn't be surprised in the slightest. Right, as we always do, let's just go around. I already see one of the targets over there. Okay. Looking very nice as always. Got a brand new area here. So we're not actually in the forest. I mean, we're in the forest. We're in a little town that's in the forest. I thought when I saw that, we were just literally going to be in the middle of the forest. The Columbia Festival. You know where she is? Yeah, revealed story. I guess we'll so, listen to this and see if we want to do it. Rico Delgado has commissioned a statue of himself to adorn the village square. Today's unveiling ceremony will feature a local band and Rico Delgado will attend in person. I suggest you take a closer look, 47. This should be a unique opportunity to engage Delgado outside the walls of his compound. Well, that seems good. Potentially no one's going to see us. Okay. And then straight away we have this up here. I mean, I'm lazy. I usually do the first thing there. I mean, if it's not going to be interesting for the video, obviously I won't. But the last game, everything we did was actually quite interesting. So 
I'll keep with it. I'll keep with the first thing I see and then see if it's actually interesting. So this one we have to go up higher. Or is it just something that we do here maybe? I have to come here and then maybe climb up. Oh, I actually, I can't be there. I literally didn't even see you there, mate. Sorry about that. So you a bit too freaking late, brother. Another mission story revealing. Can it be for the other people, please? Sabotage. Okay, so this is Delgado. So this is the Rico guy. Can I go around here and then go up? I can't. I don't know how I get up there. Maybe the other side? Yeah, let's just, let's go down here again. Let us go down the other way. Hopefully I can go that way. I know I can't go on the little stage area there now. I'm freaking aware of that, people. Up there. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I literally needed to go here. About freaking two seconds it would have taken me to go here. I can't. Okay. So I need their outfit. Or can I? Let, let's just see. Let me just see. Can I go through here? I can't. Sorry about that, guys. Didn't realize. Uh, oh, poison. That's great. For you, mate, actually. Hmm. Okay, yeah, that's not going to work. There's a, there's a nice grave here. That's great. Pick up a brick. That's fantastic. Could I do something like that? I mean, they're going to see me, obviously. What's that? Oh, this is my... Yeah, I guess I'll just pick up my coin anyway, yeah. Probably a lot safer to just have that with me. Already discovered. Okay, so you're just a normal guy. What is this? Pick up another coin. Perfect. Thank you very much. So we got two guys here. And we got two guys down there. They're all freaking staying together. Making it really hard to actually pick up one of them. Yeah, there's three guys here now. Hmm. Yeah, well, let's just continue down here for a bit. Obviously, we got three people here. That's just one person there. So it's not you, right? I, I wish it showed me, like, this person can do this, like, on top of their head. Kind like what Watch Dogs does when you, um, like, survey people. But this, this is just, yeah, this is just going back up here. Okay. That's extremely convenient. Oh, you're, you're taking a piss, are you, mate? Oh, well. Sucks to be you then, mate, isn't it? Freaking dying while having a piss. I've been seen, maybe? I don't know what that freaking... Do you see that circle that disappeared there? What is that? Oh, does that mean I'm hidden, maybe? I see. Okay. The opposite. So I'm not going to snap your neck, because I don't really like doing that. Oh, pick up a gun. Okay, fair enough. Let's hide that. Or actually, let's just not have that out, because I don't think I'm ever going to have to use that. Okay. I'm going to save a bit less regularly, because it takes quite a while on my Hello. PS4 Pro for some reason. Hello, buddy. I've got a freaking bag on my head, so I could literally be anyone right now. Pick up a soda can. Why not? And Sabotage missing a wrench. Brilliant. Spend all this freaking time getting up here. Now I realize I don't actually have the thing that I freaking need to do it. Okay, so, we have another mission story here. I have no idea where this wrench is, so I'm just going to leave that for now. Fame ...has come to Santa Fortuna. Presumably to work his magic on Rico Delgado, a known ink enthusiast. Sounds like an invitation to the mansion, 47. Are you feeling expressive? Yes, I don't really know what that means, but yes, I definitely am. I spent about 10 minutes trying to find that wrench, and I have absolutely no idea where it is. I even looked up a freaking video to try and find it, which is the first time I've done that this entire series. And I still have absolutely no clue where that is, so unfortunately we're just going to have to leave that. We're going to have to just, I guess, deal with Rico Delgado just normally, just by shooting him or just getting him into a corner and then just uh, subduing him, something like that. We need to get onto this roof, apparently. Or is it just inside for now? Yes, yeah, inside for now. Or was this the guy that the woman was talking about, maybe? Okay. I can pick up a coin. Disguise myself as this guy, okay. I can blend in there. Oh. This guy doesn't like me because I just took his coin. Okay, that's bad. Right, what are you going to do, mate? You're just there. Maybe if I... Do that, and then lead him over there, potentially? Is that something I can do? Would someone go see what the funk that was? Entendido? 
You or oh, he's going as well. Hell yes, mate. I didn't check behind me. Okay, I should be all right. Oh, she's literally right there, just looking through the freaking window. Jesus. Am I all right to just put him in there? Am I good to do that? I think I am. Okay, that's fine. All right. I am potentially gonna die now, as the guy was freaking saying. Oh, th this is just for Rico as well. Perfect. Okay, I'm fine to be here now. L locate Rico's mansion. Okay. And I can go in the mansion now. So actually, this is probably the better one to do. So it's fine that I can find the wrench. I bet I'd freaking find the wrench now doing this. I bet I freaking do. Literally right here I could do it. And then Rico comes down here. I kill him. Then we all go and have a freaking cup of tea. Instead, I've got to go to the mansion and deal with him myself now. Agent 47's time is very freaking precious right now. But apparently it's not to Rico. He's making me do all the freaking work myself. I'll dare him. Right, here we go. Use the doorbell. Amazing doorbell. Surely no one heard that. Surely. That's the worst doorbell ever. It looks cool, but the function of it is horrible. Okay, here we go. It looks nothing like her, did it say? Risking not allowed. Illegal items in inventory. Oh, okay. I meant to follow this guy, but apparently I can't. Why can't I be in here? What? You're entering the lion's den, 47. Tread carefully. Practically everyone here is dangerous, not least Rico Delgado himself. Okay, so I need to get rid of my items then, potentially? So let's just... Um, okay. I need to drop you. Drop you. I guess you as well. And the gun. And the cleaver. Can I keep the fiber wire and the crowbar? Is that alright? I don't think they're going to be illegal items. I think I just had the crowbar on me already. I should be alright to come now. Hello buddy! My face is right on your face. Social distancing is a myth. Let me freaking come in and hug you buddy. Alright, there we go. Get frisked. Here we go. Um, oh, there we go. Cool. I thought it freaking broke then because I pressed the button too early. Oh, yes. Let's knock you out now. That is the best idea. Where well, there's freaking five other guards around here. Or with freaking AKs and me with absolutely nothing. Me with my little bit of freaking fiber wire can take you all out straight away. I follow the guard. He's actually moving this time, which is nice. Would actually like to find a wrench at some point. Gustavo ended up looking like a dead chupacabra. When my brother-in-law saw the tattoo, he went down to the guy's house. Shot Is this the woman? Oh no, he's over there, okay. He was the only for I mean, I have to freaking subdue him now. I can't do- can I do anything else? I've got a- I've got a Dr. Pop soda can. Yeah, I literally- or a crowbar, I guess. I can knock him out with that. Then again, that is that a bit is loud, so it's probably not- Delgado. I agree. Wife to Rico Delgado for the past 11 years. Yeah, up here. Oh my God, I'm I've been recording for 23 and a half minutes now, and I haven't killed one of the freaking people now. It's such an honor to meet you. I just love your show. That episode where you tattoo the heart of the heart with the dead dying policeman while they're administrating CPR. Is this me? Have I been in this series? Okay, let's let's just wait, shall we? Let's wait until you're up there, and then I'll go up. So. Rico has this tattoo on his neck, and he insists it's supposed to be based on a photo of me. I'm not a fool, Mr. Powers. My nose never looks like that. Not even a Where's the guy? Oh, Was there? Let me just grab okay. a quick selfie with you, all right? Okay, then, sure. fair enough. Why not? Yay! <laughs> just Get your phone out of your freaking leg, there we go. Wow. Pretty sure you were recording that. Have you guys ever done that? Asking someone for a selfie and then you just end up freaking recording? So oh, here. Far, so good, 47. Now to leave your mark on Mr. Delgado. 
A bit more than the freaking mark, I'd say. It's a pleasure to meet you. Hello, buddy. I'm just going to be going over here. Anything over here? There's nothing. Mr. Power, it's a pleasure to meet you. You landed a few days ago. Something here, apparently, but I can't. Why did it take so long for you to get here? Oh, start tattoo. I, you know what? Never mind. Let's just get this over with. I have places to be and people to kill. You know how it goes, right? I certainly so do, do I, mate. Mr. Delgado. Okay, I'm ready. Let's get this thing fixed. I guess we're gonna kill him while doing this, then. That's just there. Okay, brilliant. Freaking woman's sure, head's in the way. It's not every day we have celebrities visiting, you know. Yeah, let, let's start the tattoo for now. Very annoying, dear. I really can't see what the problem is. Well, Are we actually hey, doing anything? Oh, don't worry. I've got this under control. You need hey, to keep still, guy. Mr. Delgado. I wouldn't want to stab One you by move. accident. You Ooh. Catalina, leave us now. Oh. Why oh, you got your gun out, mate? That tattoo better look exactly like me when you're done with your new BFF, Rico. I need you to calm down a bit, Jose. Better safe than sorry, boss. You're making me nervous, Jose. Put that thing away. Afraid I can't do that, Patron. This person might get the jump on us. Hey, Jose, I need you to leave us alone now. You're too wound up right now. Yeah. You understand? All right, and then let's boss, accidentally right. stab him. But I'll be back in a little while if I don't hear from you, way one. So, so the woman's gone. Finally, so peace and quiet. Can I okay. finish my work now? <laughs> do what you do best, man. You got it. Do what I do best, you say? Well, I in fact do this best. So let's do that. There we go. Right in the freaking ear. Imagine the other guy just hadn't freaking left yet. It was just opening the door and just happened to turn around again. We got sports car key. Okay, I guess that's how we're going to leave then. The submarine blueprints, okay. An interw item right there. Missing combination for Rico's safe. Okay, do I need that? I don't know. I don't have any intel or anything for these other two people. Because I can check here. Um Okay, that's Delgado. Done that one. Are these all just or here. Make it ideal for stealth transportation of drugs, but modifications to the design also seem to... Okay. Ranger would be highly effective if mass-produced. He matches one of Rico's sports. I guess I'd go do that now then, potentially? Buddies, um... Hello, thank you very much for not moving out of the way. Really appreciate that. Let's just vault over there. That's not going to be suspicious at all. There we go. Time flies when you're having fun. And the sports car I saw over here. There we go. I think it might be this one. What do I do with this then? Or can I do anything with it actually? I'm trespassing, but... Okay, I, I guess I can't do anything. Maybe that's just a way of leaving, as I said before. And now, I believe... Is there another one in here? There is, actually. But he's quite far away. I don't think he's going to be actually in there. So we got another one of the targets in here, apparently. Yeah, there we go. Obviously, these guys, I don't sure, think I'm allowed in anymore, right? Area. Yeah, I probably should have done that first, because obviously I did have a disguise for them. Fine. Or maybe, if I find where I did that, where I killed this guy, I might be able to do that, because I'd obviously have his, yes, down here. I'd obviously have my disguise out already. Unless they remove the disguises, like when the body when the people with the body bags come in. Do they remove the disguises and all of the items as well? If they don't, if they only remove the bodies, or as we've seen, I don't think the body's been found. Oh yeah, because the body I put in the freaking dumpster, right? Or just wherever's over here. So I should be alright. I'm alright to come through here. Yeah, here we go. Perfect. Soldier. Amazing. So I didn't actually waste that, but obviously this guy remembers me. Never mind, he didn't even freaking see me. Amazing. See, I could have got that guy right there. Okay, so now I'm back here and I should be allowed to go in here, right? That Was that? Oh, that's you. Okay, never mind. So I'm just going to follow her for a bit. She's got these two guards following her now. I just want to see where she goes and then hopefully I can just pick these guys off eventually and then she'll just be alone. 
But she can't see them, because I think if she sees them go, she might just run back to where she was already. What does that do? Oh, that, yeah, it's just that, okay. She's talking to a wall at the moment, that's brilliant. And then she continues over here. But these guys might eventually not be with her anymore. Well, she's going to go on the stage? Oh, is that why then I can throw the, the statue on her, maybe? Hmm. Can I go up here? Oh, she's going again. I was about to say, can I go on the balcony and then just shoot her from there? Maybe I can, actually. Martinez is down. Am I good? good oh yes, part of it. Okay. I probably wasn't good, but now I am because I'm hiding in here. Okay, so they're both leaving now. Let's go out quickly. Okay, so I thought maybe because I needed to um, open that door with a crowbar as well. So I was going to go out quickly and then hopefully open that as soon as possible. Okay, so... So this is back here. I need to be the other side of that. Okay, so I had a look on the map and I realized that I actually do need to go back to the mansion. And then there's this little area here. And then this guy's down there. So now I am in this area, but it's very much so hostile. And I think actually the best idea is to probably get one of these guys to go over here. They shouldn't see me because I'm in this foliage area here. So one of these guys comes here. The other guy turns around, hopefully. Got it. Perfect. Oh. Well, that's bad. Actually, that's perfect. Okay, fair enough. And pick up a coin. And this guy is not dead. Okay, so disguise myself as him. I need to get rid of this guy still. The triangle. There we go. We should be all right now. If we just get out of here. I mean, it's not a hostile area anymore. So that's good. Just had to get rid of them guys. Obviously because I don't have any weapons. Because to come through here in the first place. You need to get rid of all of your hostile weapons. But we should all be good. We should be good with all of these guys now. Potentially not when I go over to where the guy is. Which is right in here. Can I go in here? I'm good. Okay. I'm trespassing. Never mind. I'm not good. So I obviously can't go in there. We got this guy here actually. Okay. This could be very good. Okay. I think you've seen me. But if I... Can I throw a coin in there? I can't throw a coin anymore. Why? Why can't I throw a coin? I can't throw a coin in. Oh, I can throw a coin. Oh, it's just I couldn't freaking see it. I am throwing a coin, but I just couldn't see the white line because, um... Was I in the freaking bushes? Are you, mate? I assume that you can go in there. Obviously, you're not actually in there. And I can't see any of you in there. I assume that you're allowed to go in there, potentially. Bit more over here, mate, because I'm pretty sure your fellas would freaking see you there. You heard that? Go see. Affirmative. You're going in, hopefully a bit more. There. Okay. And you shouldn't be seen because this foliage is actually perfect freaking height right here. Right. Perfect. Didn't freaking see anything in there, mate. I'm just going to continue going. Can I go in here now? Am I allowed? Obviously I'm allowed. I know that because I'm where the freaking person I am here. I have no idea what I am, but I mean, yes, I do know what I am. I'm just going to pick up these cocaine bricks because that's freaking amazing. I'm going to have a hammer, apparently. That's great. So who's the guy? The guy is the guy not even in here anymore. He's not even freaking in here anymore, is he? That's great. He's gone all the way over here for some reason. When did he do this? I have no idea. Apparently he's gone over this way now. That is Jorge Franco, the Delgado right there. Cartel's chief chemist. Oh, I was literally about to say I could shoot him now, but I actually can't, can I? So he's in here right now. He is right behind that door. I don't know what to do now. I've been stuck on this for quite a while. I think I might just shoot him and then hope for the best. I don't think I'm going to be able to do anything else. Actually, maybe right now... Maybe if I do a coin, would he go in and see what it is? No. Okay. Hmm. I'm, I'm going to see. I'm going to see if I can get away with it. All targets neutralized. 
This should paralyze the cartel. Okay, they're shooting at me, so I'm going to the car. If I can make it, then I'm going to the car. I don't know where this is going. I guess I'm going to go this way. I don't know. Ooh. Is, it, is this a sufficient way to go? I'm going under everything. I guess this might be good. I'm trespassing. Okay, this is a very bad idea. That's locked. Yeah, it's right on top of me. Um, okay, someone's shooting at me. Let me just see. So I'm here. So I need to go this way then, right? Yeah, right here. Right here I can go upstairs. Is there a door there? If there was a door there, that would have been amazing. Oh, please say, okay, I can go through here. I don't know where I am. I have no idea where I am. Where am I? Can I go anywhere here? Mate, I'm trespassing for two seconds. I'll be leaving as soon as I can. Please don't shoot me. Okay, here we go. Then all I need to do is... Okay, brilliant. This is going amazingly. Right, the car. I know where the car is. Can I get there? It's literally right there. Please. Please, I am begging you. Can I freaking get the car? Can I get to the car even? Oh, come on. It's right there. It's right there. Oh, can I do it? Maybe hiding over here is a good idea. Oh, did I, did I make it, please? Oh, I made it, I think. Hopefully. Please, please don't say you know that I'm in here. I think they would have started shooting at me if they knew. I'm pretty sure they would have started shooting at me already if they knew I was in here. I think I'm fine. Then as soon as you go back, mate, I'm going to freaking crawl my way to that red sports car in there. I'm going to get my freaking self the hell out of here. This has been the longest recording so far. This is an hour and ten minutes now. Definitely been the hardest. Just because that freaking old man, I didn't know how to do it. Rather than just shoot him. I had no idea how I was meant to freaking do that any other way. Oh. I think I messed it up. I think I messed it up. I think I might have messed it up. I think I'm just going to have to get out and shoot them. Maybe not. Maybe they actually need to save me. I think I might have saved myself by doing that. Okay. Amazing. You're going to go there, mate. I'm going to freaking exit the mission. Finally, the third mission in Hitman 2 is completed. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is episode number 10. We are now in double digits. Mission status. Columbia assignment successful. Tactical targets neutralized. Militia transport network disabled. Location of primary target unknown. Team chasing several leads. End message, encrypt and send. I'm not as strong as you. They have to pay for what they did. It needs to stop. You need to stop. If my source checks out, we can prove the board knew about the chemical leaks. We'll have grounds for a retrial. It won't make a difference. They're too powerful. They're not the devil, Nancy. Just a company. They're not above the law, don't you see? This is bigger than James. Those bastards killed 80 people. And they got away with it. Think about what that means. No one's untouchable. No one's untouchable. Diana! Coming!
We got what we came for. Move out. 